Hello there. Hello there. Uh, welcome to Call of the Sea. Oh, I'm on the wrong side. You can't see the title. Whoop. Boop. Hi. Uh, welcome to Call of the Sea. Um, today is normally the day that I play Professor Layton. But I am incredibly tired. Uh, I have about just enough energy to do a stream. But I do not have enough energy to focus on the amount of puzzles that Professor Layton would supply. This is still a puzzle game, but it is not quite the same kind of puzzle game, and I feel like I can cope with this a little better. Uh, if you weren't here the last time we played this, I'll give you a quick synopsis because I feel like we're quite close to the end of the game. So spoilers, if you haven't, if you want to play this yourself, uh, now's your time to leave because I'm going to spoil what happens. Um, this is Nora. Uh, Nora's got a strange disease that affects her skin but also um, lots of other parts of her health and uh, her husband ventured off into the world to find a cure because he found a clue that it said that there was this um, strange island that had information about the disease. Anyway, she he then went missing and stopped responding to letters so she uh, has come to find what's going on, gone on with him and over the course of the game so far uh, has discovered that lots of people have died. Um, lots of things have been found out and essentially that she is, we don't fully understand it yet, but she is basically a fish person and is slowly turning into a fish person. Like she's got fish person blood or something um, and she can breathe underwater. But um, I feel like that's pretty much all you need. There's been a lots of little things that have happened, but she hasn't found Harry and he apparently couldn't get past a certain point. So I don't know if he's dead and we just haven't found his body or what's happened, but we're just going to jump into it. Oh, I played it with a controller last time. I should probably plug in my controller, right? Give me a sec. I'm going to do that. Um, ba -ba -da -ba -da. Oh, yes. And the black ooze. There was a lot of black ooze that we were all worried about um which kind of is part of the disease or it like simulates the disease or there were oh yeah there was a race of people and half of them were slaves to the other half and the slaves would have their um eyes they'd basically be bathed in this black ooze it was all very strange but now we're in their like ancient underwater um home And see why my hands are all weird? It's because I'm a fish person at the moment. But I can uh, transform back and forth when I go to those little purple things. So I need to find the other purple. Actually, no, I think I'm supposed to be going this way, aren't I? You work this out, which is like this. Oh, but then there's a wall. Oh no. Yeah, yeah. So then there's a big wall. And that's where I stopped. And last time I remember I was playing and I was really tired, but I kept being like, I'm gonna keep going because we're almost at the end, but we never were. And we never got to the end. So um Yeah, that's kind of what's up. That's what what you missed on Glee. Uh I am still pretty tired today, but I feel like this game I can I can cope with this game while being tired. Lots more than the other puzzle games I'm playing at the moment. I think I already looked at these. All of these little um pools of black ooze give me like a vision. I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do now because I'm clearly supposed to get through that wall but it's not open at the moment so I don't really know. I also have a notebook but I can't look at it while I'm in the water because obviously I don't want to make it waterlogged. Different types of creatures of the same species lived here but they weren't free. I'll tell you what though, I do love a good underwater level. Not like in a in a stressful way where you have to like find air, but like in this kind of way. I just love the sound of being underwater. I can't explain it. It's just like so calming to me. It's weird. That's a nice one. So these creatures are immortal? You're immortal. Um, also, that little boom thing that you might have heard, that was an achievement. 
Who went and seen these before? Whoa. Very this soothing. looks like an altar dedicated to two figures. I can hear them talking to me. Very soothing, but you don't have to worry about drowning. Exactly. If I could just like breathe underwater, but not like with a not with like scuba gear, just like naturally, I'd be set. See, the other gates in there. I can't actually climb out of the water while I'm in fish mode. Like, I can't change back. There's nothing I can do. I can't go back up there. I'm not 100% sure what I'm just- Oh, hold on. Is this a gate? Oh no, this is the way I came in, isn't it? Yeah, that's the way I came in. Oh, it's the little thing is broken. This panel is broken. I'll have to find another way to go through. Okay. I am slowly picking up on stuff. So those little gates change back and forth when you sort of solve the puzzle on the little panel. And they have like a little gust of... of... <laughs> Short one this month. Slash dun 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 trumpet solo. Jimbo. 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 Trumpet continues. Jimbo. 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 Ow ow ow. Smash. <laughs> I love the smash. That was my favorite bit. Thank you so much for eight months, Shogun. Oh my gosh, it's almost it's almost stream baby time. Not just real baby. Um, thank you very much for your eight months, and thank you for your wonderful message, as always. I think if I do a do do, a do do, a do a do what, a do be, a do wait. Oh, I thought I was in like a cave. I'm not. Um, a, a subathon, like I was planning. I will um probably count the subs so far as like part of it. Ooh, can I? Oh, I can't get there. Okay. I don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, I'm supposed to be getting into that, that tunnel that I couldn't get into. But... Anything behind the waterfall? Aw, oh, boo! I can see that there's something in there, but I can't get through. Look. Oh, I guess that's the end of this tunnel, isn't it? So I have to find another way into this tunnel, because I can't go the, the intended route. Because uh, the, the entrance is broken. How do I get in? Is this anything? Oh, it's got a little button on it. Oh, there we go. That's the door I was trying to go through. Wonderful. So now we can go this way. Ah, I made it. Is there even anything in here? Oh, oh, great. The door closed. Wunderbar. Can I go this way? Ah, yes. Okay. Thanks, glowing coral, for guiding me. My illness has kept me from being happy. What I feel now is the complete opposite of being sick. I feel full of life and energy, even better than before my illness. Because you're supposed to be a fish person. 
in your blood. Is there a way for you to go through? That's true. It could have been a timed thing. That would have been fun. Ah. Wait. Ah, here we go. Bloop. And now I'm human again. Very slow. So slow. Oh, I'm on the other side of this bit. That was a really long winded way to get over here, wasn't it? I don't know if I'm supposed to do that, but I, I, I imagine I am. And there's the now tunnel. The water level is really low, so I can access that tunnel. There we go. Guess I'm supposed to go probably this way. These creatures live like slaves, all their lives imprisoned and tortured in this place. Was it possible to live a decent life in here? If you've lived all your life in a prison, how would you know that you are a prisoner? Very deep. Oh, there's the tunnel. Is this then? Is this a button? Oh, this doesn't appear to do anything. Oh no, that was the button I pushed before. Because that's the, the first of the... Right, okay. I've got my bearings now. Some questions. Now, now I can enter this tunnel. Do you have your dress when you turn into a fish person, or do you magically hold your clothes elsewhere when you transform? That's a good point. We only see my arms, but I imagine it would be more tricky to swim in the dress. Um, I'm going to say that it's like wild shape rules where your clothes disappear, but like they just become part of your other form. So you're not naked. Fish again! Oh no. Okay. I think I remember how to do these. Pretty sure I'm supposed to. Oh no, I need to change this. is quite strong. I wonder where it will take me. Ooh, for a cutscene. I like in Abzu again. Abzu's a nice game if you haven't played it. a ride but it's over now well i mean i see we aren't running around the island naked but also who knows the cultural norms of fish people it's true i mean i haven't seen anybody else so there's not much of a problem with me being completely naked ah here we go sounded unfriendly 
it had a roar. I always thought it might be like one of the fish people, but they'd evolved, so they're absolutely massive now. And they were like, oh my Another. god, there's a fish person. Someone set up camp in here. I wonder if that somebody was Harry. Looks like a means of transportation to get to that sanctuary. With all of the bound fish people. Ooh. More stuff. I mean, at least Harry wasn't here to like get gold or something. Like he was here for very Seems noble reasons. Seems to show reason. two possible courses of action. One means transformation, and the other means death. Ooh. Okay, that's intriguing. Is it different sides of the temple, maybe? Am I writing- oh good, I am writing it all in my book. Oh, it was a timed door, apparently. It must have just been a good, uh, good timing. Let me just make sure I've looked all of it. There we go. Hello, my husband. I'm a fish person now. He knows that, because he figured out that I was turning into a fish person. But I really hope it's not a body. That would be really, that would really suck. Nope. Still not here. I mean, at least that means that you might not be dead. What is this? This, this... Oh my god. Did I almost forget about Harry? Nora. Somebody painted these symbols on the- Shut up. Shut up, Nora. You followed the river from the temple summit, and it took you some days to find this entrance. I thought he said he couldn't figure things out, and that's why he, he was left behind. Oh dear, poor people. Is this why I'm changing too? So the sanctuary was the final stage of the ritual took place. The master's A brought sanctuary? The... Harry was that- Ah, leader? that's why I was on that side. Hello. Uh, the Masters brought their slaves to a sanctuary by boat in order to perform the final stage of the ritual. A sanctuary? I thought she said, Harry, were you wounded? That's why I got her to repeat it. So the guide left the expedition. That would explain the workshop on the White Sand Beach, where I arrived. The death of the silence. I helped as long as I could, but I won't be accomplished to this ritual madness. I'm returning to the White Sand Beach to build a raft and leave this. Okay. Give me a change of mind. I won't wait too long. She doesn't seem to care much about Harry. And she doesn't seem to be thinking straight either. Harry's mental decline is more evident each day, but the day he said he found some place to carry out some ritual. I have to get to the bottom of this. I have to keep doing what I've been doing up to now. Listen to what he has to say and go along with him. I can't stand him, but I have to tread lightly because it's only him and me now. Uh-oh. <gasps> Harry, that look on your face. Oh no. You look deranged. They seem to loathe each other. Let's hope that they actually do load each other. Not the sun is setting. Thing. It is so beautiful. Yeah, this is all, this is all taking place in one day. No, because it was dark when we were checking the boat, so I guess it's been a couple of days. Wow. Very pretty. I want to get that ladder. I guess that might be a way up. Uh, maybe a shortcut later? Since I can't get it right now. Okay. Back to the water. I've been staring at the edge of the water. Etc. My voice is really croaky. I had a bit of a, a cough yesterday, like a tiny one, and now it's definitely getting worse. Long as I can remember, never really knowing why, I would like to keep this daughter, but I come back to the water, no matter how hard I try. Oh, thanks! Can you just give me a boost? 
Ooh, hello. What's this thing? Is this funky? Oh, is this the symbols that he wrote in the book? I think it is. Oh, I've missed something. Look, there's a massive page there. This ah, there we go. That panel works. looks different from the others. It's much more elaborate. He did swirl. Huh. Oh, okay. Swirl three, five of the lightning. That one. Okay, I'm not going to remember to do that, but let's try. Kayla, this is Call of the Sea. Um, it is a puzzle game. Um, and it is because I have not got the brain to delay in today. I am very I'm coming down with a cold. But I felt like I could do at least one stream before I I succumb to the sickness. I get down with the sickness when I'm gonna open my bag of sweeties. Catch some sweet. Give myself some trigger. We do love a puzzle game. How are you doing, Mahela? Right. So, basically, what we have to do is we have to hit these buttons. And you see they fill the little tunnel. And we have to get all of them to hit the center at the same time. Oh no, I did that wrong. Okay, I'm gonna wait for it to finish. Oh look, those two hit the center. I mean, okay, there's been some things going on, but I just keep on trucking, you know? I feel that. I've, I feel like I've had the same at the moment. There's been some stuff going on. And then I got sick. Yeah, I think I've been... I think that this cold has been coming for a while because I was so tired last week. You go back and watch the VODs, I was just like, I'm gonna try and do puzzles anyway! Uh, and I was just really struggling and I had to cancel the stream. So I think it's been like, slowly creeping up on me. Um, I haven't done a COVID test yet, I will do one tonight. Hopefully it's not that. Hopefully it's just like a cold or the flu or something. Um, but yeah, I've just been spending my time editing instead, um, which is difficult to do when you can't concentrate, but it's it's easier than streaming. So I've had I've had my ideas, but I'll talk to you guys about that later. I've had some ideas. Also, Mahela, I want to show you my shirt. This is my new merch. I'm so excited for it. It's not available yet. I haven't put, I haven't opened the shop yet, but <laughs> I love it. So excited. Anyway. Thank you. I might get, I might, um, at some point when I have a bit more money, if I get a new job, I might commission somebody to make, like, another puzzle solved. Exactly! That's why it's set. yes! Correct! Um, but, uh, I get, like, commissioned some artwork or something for some shirts, because I've already got my logo and things like that, but... <laughs> right, anyway. So we need to do... Do I need to take a picture of this so I can get it? without having to keep opening. I'm gonna- I'm gonna take a photograph so I don't have to keep opening my notebook to do this right. It was really funny, like, after we finished Nancy Drew, going through my phone and, like, deleting all of the things I'd taken photos of for Nancy Drew. Right, okay, so we're gonna go... Ready? Okay. One. One, two, three, four, five. One. 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 
that's not right. That's not right at all. There must be some kind of break to it. I'm not sure how though. Or I could just try and time it myself. Is that like, there's like a dot between them. I'm wondering if that's like a second break. Like, see how they've got a dot there? I'm wondering if that's like, I have to wait like a second before I hit the next one. So, let's try that. I got all I got three of them. Hmm. You know what's probably a better technique? I'm gonna I'm gonna time each of them. And we'll do it that way. Oh. Oh, damn it. The app crashed. Just over 10 seconds, though. Let, let's hold on, let's try that again. We'll do a little timer, and then we'll do the maths that way. And in the time, meantime, I'm going to have more of my coffee. What? Why is it not working? There, it worked that time. I could count, but okay, that was 15 seconds roughly. Oh, I should write this down. See, this is why this is this is a um, there's a puzzle game that I really like, um, that I recently bought, so I'm very excited to play it at some point on stream. It's not really a puzzle game, it's more I'd say it's more of a detective game, but I played the demo of it on stream, so some of you will remember it. It was called Keyword a Spider's Thread, and in that. Uh, yeah, Ty was like, I don't want to, you're too tired to work, I don't want to work either. Um, and in that you had, like, the ability to take notes, but it wasn't just, like, in this where she takes the notes that are important. Like, I have to pick what notes were important and type them in. Basically, it wasn't just, like, a notebook, it was, like, a digital notebook, but I had to, like, write things down for later. And I really like that as an idea because it's like, I do it in real life anyway. Like I make notes for games when I'm streaming them anyway. So why not have it incorporated into the game? I thought that was super cool. Right, let's do this back here. Um, but yeah, I've now bought it because it was on sale. That was about 12 seconds. Oh no, I forgot to put the timer. Ah, hold on. Who is he drawing the eye? I'm wondering if he was using the... That was about 10 seconds. I'm wondering if he was using the symbols in his little, um, in his notes there as, like, how long... Oh wait, do you know what that probably is? I've just had a thought. That probably means the spiral takes the same time as five of the lightning bolts. And the little egg timer symbol, whatever that is, the one on the right, takes as long as an eyeball and a lightning bolt. It's like it's like maths. It's like the whole um if A is equal to B and C and B is equal to C and D, what is A? You know? It's one of those. I think that's what it's supposed to be. I'm just going to continue with my current technique because I think I might have, and I, we might be getting somewhere with this, but um, I think that's what it's supposed to be. That was about three seconds, maybe four seconds. Um, which explains, yep, yeah, because if the lightning bolt was three seconds, then the swirl is five lightning bolts. 
there we have it. Okay, so what we need to do is we need to do swirl, then three seconds later do the one on the right, then th two seconds. Okay, okay, I think I can do this. So. One elephant, two one elephant, two elephant. Oh, I'm too slow. Okay, I didn't have my elephant. My elephants were too sh too long. Right, what we need to do is I need to just go for it. I think I can do it. I'll do that next. Should be it. This must yeah. be my transportation to the sanctuary. Look at that! <laughs> Another puzzle solved, baby. Oh, they had right the back side. Onward. I figured out what his notes meant. It was an equivalence. Because it wasn't like an equal sign or something. I didn't realize that's what it was trying to say. But I got it. We got it. Oh, oh, new chapter. Good thing I didn't just try and keep pushing through last time. I never would have got this. Imagine me trying to solve that puzzle last week when I was like so dopey. Well, at least we know she's not naked. Oh, I'm not going to try and pronounce that. It all makes sense. Nothing bad is going to happen to me here. As menacing as this place might look. Harry on the, the island, the ooze, those sea creatures. They're just defending themselves. Like a wild animal against an unknown threat. That's how they perceived the expedition. Look at that. Like a threat. But I, on the other hand, I wasn't a threat. And I definitely wasn't unknown, was I? Oh, <gasps> squeed! Big squeed. They to recognize me as if I was one of their own. That wasn't what we saw. We have learned something about the transformation. It includes your clothes. Everything seems so distant now. As if I first stepped on that white beach thousands of years ago. This is really cool. But the thing is, is we don't know a if there are any moon? fish people still alive. It can't be. Yesterday was... Yesterday was a new moon. Did I lose track of time or... We're not on Maybe Earth anymore. Maybe this place isn't subject to the laws of physics. That's the only explanation I can find for this surreal night. Look at the sky, though. It's hard to believe everything is real. Maybe it isn't. Maybe I'll open my eyes sometime and I'll be back in our home in Inglewood and... Everything will be as before. You don't want that, do you? My you sound sad perfectly about it. ordinary life with Harry. My daily routines. My illness. That will be as before, too. I really hope Harry's still alive. This is gonna suck. And then I'll need to shake off this strange feeling that I have now. Feeling that I don't really belong there anymore. And with there, I don't mean Englewood or Boston or Newburyport. I mean. Don't say with Harry. <sighs> How is it possible that the strange events of only two days on this island? Makes more sense to me than the life that I've been living for years. Because you're a fish person, isn't it? Ooh, there it is. 
The sanctuary. What's the story? Ah, so um, basically, so is this where you went, Harry. Was this your last stop? Basically, uh, this is Nora, and um, Nora has a disease that has affected her skin, but it also we don't really know exactly what it does, but it, it's this weird hereditary disease that she got, and her husband Harry. Uh, decided to go and try and look for a cure because the doctors couldn't help them and ended up in this wild, strange island. Uh, and she he stopped responding to her letters, so she came looking for him. And she's basically been following throughout this island and slowly discovering that she's actually a fish person. Which, you know, as you do, just a normal, uh, normal Saturday night, you know. So yeah, we're really hoping that her husband Harry is inside this temple and he's not dead because she's come an awful long way to find him and he's she's, both of them have gone through a lot. Another camp, although it's little more than a few things scattered about. Oh, this is a letter for her. I'm going to sit back and have some sweeties. My dear old pal, I never should have trusted Cass. I thought she cared about you, but she's just mad, obsessed with this place. I can't trust her to help me overcome the last obstacle. This door. I know how to open it. But what I have to do is mix my blood with the black ooze. Am I mad for even considering that? It's the only way we can be together. It has to work, right? All this can't be a coincidence. The ritual is made for the two of us. Isn't it, Nora? I wish you could be here to... Damn it. I, th I have to think it over. I can't. I, uh, to tomorrow. Leave it for tomorrow, damn it. Stop writing. What are you saying, Harry? Don't you see what the Black Ooze does? What it did to the Doctor? Are you out of your mind? Oh, speaking of the Doctor, happy birthday to David Tennant. So yeah, basically Harry took his whole um, expedition crew, but the only ones who are still alive are him and this woman, whose name is Cass. We didn't know that till now. A library? What are you talking about, Harry? Was the blood of these creatures... Some... Oh, I forgot she stopped speaking when I do that. Heavens, this dagger looks exactly like the one I have. Yeah. Harry, what is this? It looks like the ramblings of a madman. I mean, he's kind of been on this island for a while, and it's it doesn't exactly help your mental state. Alright, guess it's time to go and see if we can find our husband, who's uh, not exactly the best right now. However, interestingly... I mean, so far in this game, we haven't seen a single, um, a single other person outside of, like, the, the letters. So we haven't actually seen, like, a model of a person yet. So I have a feeling we're not gonna find, we're not gonna find him. Black ooze on a Petri dish. My god, this syringe has traces of black ooze. What the hell were you thinking? He told you what he was thinking. <laughs> These patterns look too familiar. Oh, I really hope this works. Ouch. That seems like a silly way to open a door. Like... Like, they've set that up. So... In order to get into their temple, some they gotta cut themselves. That seems like a silly thing to do. Did they usually did like did these ancient people just have a oh dear trail of blood? Someone was hurt. Someone got shot. Oh my goodness! And the gun barrel is empty. Boom. A woman's earring stained with blood. My God, Harry. What did you do to her? Sorry, I, I, didn't, I keep forgetting that it turns off the, the audio He's behind that door. I wonder which Harry I'll find. How much would be left of the man I love? 
And how much of the man who has lost his sanity in this place? Yeah, these ancient people be like, oh, I'm going off to the temple. Oh, don't forget to take your um, cart and a blood with you so you can open the door. Hmm, an eye and a star. <gasps> Look at the stars, maybe. The stars are aligned, forming a constellation that I don't recognize. That is not the same sky you can see from Earth. And if that that's not the Earth sky, where am I now? Atlantis. Wait, that's the water. Let's have a look at these uh, notes first. All these papers are riddled with incoherent doodles. I mean, it's not incoherent. It's got stars on it. Hmm. I wonder what this means. Those stone statues seem to rotate with this switch. Hmm. And now we have a puzzle. Oh, is this it's one a pentagon-shaped symbol with channels in its edges. What was it used for? Mm. I thought this was going to be like the one where I had to push the buttons, but it seems to not have buttons. Excuse me. Excuse me. Thank you. Ooh. Ooh. That's cool. Circular stones with strange carved symbols. Could be that. Okay, pushing them does nothing. At least not at the moment. Maybe I have to get the other set out as well? Ooh, there's a carving over there I never looked at. Ooh, piece of candy. Okay, don't fall into the black ooze, gotcha. They carried these people here to test them. Like a challenge of some sort. Okay, maybe I have to actually go up the doors. Oh, why am I stuck? Let's go down the steps. Where is this door leading me? Okay, cool. So I have to go and like write down the, the, the constellations on the doors. A shining constellation. I better draw it. Don't mind me. What was he meaning about the rotating thing? I don't see anything that rotates. Hmm, I wonder what this means. See these little buttons? Constellations and stars. These people seem to worship otherworldly gods. Okay, let's try this now. Can I do it now? Okay, nothing seems to be happening. Nothing does it. That, none of that does anything. So those are already depressed. Where is he seeing that shape? I don't know where, that, I don't know where that's coming from. Maybe it's through the doors? Okay. It's a pentagon-shaped symbol with channels in its edges. What was it used for? Obviously for the stars, but I can't seem to do anything with them yet. Like nothing. I thought these would like light up a certain section.
Maybe I can only do one at I can only A shining constellation. Oh. I better draw it. Wait, is there something else I've missed? You have to find something. Yeah, I think that must be it. Let's open these doors. Well, I assume it's the door. I might be wrong. Oh, must walk into the black ooze. Oh. Hmm. It said something seemed like it rotated, but I don't know where he saw that. Can you look about that thing? I mean, he seems pretty compass bendis if you can make this kind of notes. Right. I'm gonna check every one of these in case one of them works. I mean, it makes sense that what I'm gonna, what I need to do is overlay, like the shapes, so I can make the constellations. But. None of them... Nothing happens when I push those buttons. Okay, hold on. Is there... I'm so confused. Like, that logically seems like, you know, we, we, we do puzzles here. We're fairly up to scratch with puzzles, right? In Sign of seems like that should be what I'm doing. I'm overlay overlapping the shapes so that I can make. But look, there's a whole page of something I've missed. There's a massive gap. There must be something I haven't spotted yet. Another well, puzzle solved. Except it isn't. We haven't solved it. Hmm, an eye and a star. <gasps> Look at the stars, maybe. I did that already. It didn't help. On Earth 5 constellations on the dials. Yeah, do you think there's another one that I haven't spotted yet? There's one, there's four doors, which are the constellations, and the one in the sky. But I haven't drawn that one, and I can't. Like, it doesn't give me the option. I'm gonna go back outside. If nothing else, and to get a fresh perspective. I did draw the one in the sky. No, I didn't. Top right. Oh! Oh! I don't know one of the ones from the doors. Did I miss one of the doors then? Oh, I haven't seen this. Right, let's go draw this. This mural seems to describe a ritual involving blood. That dagger. Where are you getting the blood from? I can't see any blood there at all. I mean, I know that... I know it worked must be what I was supposed to do but oh another tent oh they must be tents they must have hung out separately a camera it must be Cassandra's zoom Harry asleep in his tent what a creepy ah! photograph oh my gosh sorry for shouting Hello, hello, welcome, and hi Sky, how are you doing? Hello, welcome. I have a raid thing now. Aren't you, aren't you excited? Um, thank you so much for that follow as well. Um, and welcome in. I'm in an ad right now, but hello. <laughs> oh yes, there is an ad. That's brilliant timing. Thanks Twitch. Um, 
Well, in that case, I'm still going to play my raid video. Uh, I'll wait for the raid. I'll wait for the ad to end. Put the music on for a sec. This is awkward, huh? Um, well, I think I've got an idea of what I need to do next. Um, maybe. I'm going to check all the doors and make sure I wrote all of them down. I feel like I drew down a constellation from the this guy. Bum, ba -dum, bum. Do I actually have it as a button? I'm pretty sure I made it as a button. I did. Cool. We're good. We're good. Hmm. Thanks for that other follow. Hello, hello. Right, so now you're back from the ad. Hello. Um Thank you so much, Sky, for the raid. Can I, I will do a shout out in a second for you. Um, if you don't already follow Sky. So the Professor Layton sound, yes, we are big Professor Layton fans on this on this channel. Normally I play Professor Layton on a Wednesday, but I do not have the brain today, so I am uh not playing that. I'm playing something else. But also Um, I'm gonna pop you guys on a raid video. It's basically just my latest highlight reel. Don't press that. <gasps> You don't know what you're doing. Thank you! What the heck? That's wonderful! Thank you so much for that! Oh my gosh, you just got here! Thank you so much for that that sub as well! I'm gonna play a quick raid video. Um, I'll do a shout out for Sky and I will be right back with you. See you guys in a sec. I forgot I muted myself. Thank you again so much for that raid. Hello, welcome in everyone. It is lovely to have you here. Thank you for those follows and thank you for that sub. I appreciate you very much. Um, I did a shout out, but you guys, we, we all know Sky here. If you've been in my channel for any amount of time, you know Sky. Sky is amazing. Sky does really great content about um, analyzing games um, and also just fun stuff too. Um, not that analyzing games isn't fun. You know what I mean. You know what I'm trying to say. Um, and makes great YouTube videos as well, may I just say. Um, but yeah, hello, we're, we, we're playing Call of the Sea today. Uh, this guy's all going to cut off. I'm, scared. I'm really scared. Um, we're playing Call of the Sea today. Normally on a uh, Wednesday, I play Professor Layton, but I um, i am very, very tired. I'm coming down with some kind of cold or something. And so my brain is not functioning properly. Uh, so I thought instead of trying to struggle through those puzzles, I'd struggle through these puzzles a little bit, which are a little bit easier. Um, we are quite close to the end of the game, so warning for that. Uh, and yes, also if you haven't been here before, hello, my name is Lara. I am a variety streamer. I love puzzle games um, and cooking. Uh, well, you kind of saw. You saw. You saw my, my clips of what I do. Uh, and I'm going to jump back into the game now. So let's get that Animal Crossing music off and get back to the game. 
So. Oh, I've not tabbed in. Hold on. A creepy photograph. Um, oh my, she sounds completely out of her mind. Oh. Okay, so maybe both of them had gone a bit mad. Moby Dick. Its pages are hollowed out and its shape is... <gasps> oh no. Uh oh. That helps. I can't actually see when it's like that. So I... I have to put my hand inside? He's yelling. It, it's not working. Interesting. Where is that? I don't even know where that is. Is that in there? Is that a clue? Um, yeah, so the plot of this game is... Oh, there it is! The plot of this game is that... Um, Nora, the character we are playing, has a hereditary disease that is basically it ha it, it's showing up as um, skin pigmentation but also a bunch of other things including fatigue uh, and her husband Harry went on this adventure around the world to try and find a cure because basically it's a completely unknown disease that the doctors can't help. Also this is set in the 1930s so um, and uh, has basically stopped responding to letters so she came to find him and has slowly uncovered through her journey on this island that she is actually a fish person. I swear it makes sense. Uh, Let's give it a try. So, at the moment I'm human, but I can become a fish. Ouch! Oh! Ah, what was Oh, there that? we go! Looks like a tattoo, but it isn't. Those are my spots. They've moved. This is basically the plot of Shadow of Rinsworth. Oh, no! I actually have never... Um, read or witnessed anything about that i just know vague things about it and i seem to have a theme at the moment that we're playing lovecrafty games like i'm playing dredge as well uh for those who haven't been here before which is a fishing game but everything's kind of lovecraftian but without being lovecraft um because it's not actually based on it it's just that kind of vibe you know with the weird fish and stuff um and there's a new sherlock holmes game which is based on a lovecraftian story so it's all just like what is happening with me recently? They're not. This hasn't been intentional. I haven't intentionally been linking these up. Um, there we go. Okay. So maybe now I can use it. Can I use it? Oh, there we go. Look. These icons on the wheel are the same as the constellations I have in my hand. Okay, but I can only click that one. Do I have to go back outside and get them each one by one? Hmm. Let's go and have a look at the other ones. Lovecraft without the issues, yes. I'm not sure if I'm actually making a a symbol that exists in this book, but let's have a look. Yeah, the, the journal's pretty neat actually. It's got um like it shows you this is all sure, we'll go right back to the end. So this is basically the whole adventure. So if, for example, I stopped playing it for like a month, I could come back and read about all of this. This is all the backstory. I haven't been reading this, by the way. There's so much of it. But essentially, it's just everything that she finds. This is where the actual game begins. So this is all the stuff she found prior to it. Um, and it just like explains all of the puzzles that she's found and all of the artwork on the walls that she is like drawn. And I've missed a bunch of stuff on this page, which is really annoying. Um, you get, like, achievements for finding all of the pieces of lore, basically, and I've missed some, which I'm a bit cross about. But yeah, there's been so much- I kept thinking we were at the end and then something else would happen. And that's what she look. that's what her arms look like when she becomes a fish person. They, like, go all webby and cool. Um, yeah. Okay, I don't know if I'm- like I said, I don't know if I'm actually drawing- do I have to go back out and keep sticking my hand in it? A fish person? Yeah, she um, she becomes a fish person. Ah. Uh, we don't know what she looks like, though, because there have been no mirrors. <laughs> so we don't have a clue what she looks like. No, I don't know if that did anything. Let's... Okay, that's clearly not one of them. So I think what I need to do is I need to... 
God, do I really don't have to, hope I don't have to keep going back and forth? That's going to be really annoying. Oh, wrong button. Um, okay, so which one is the... This is the bottom as drawn by... in my book. So, oh no, it's not. It's like this. That's how it's drawn in the book. Yes, right. So, I... In order to get these different constellations... Oh, this is really awkward, actually. This is gonna be- this is gonna be a lot of figuring out. Let's go and turn them all off again. I'm gonna go see if my- my theory is right that I get one symbol at a time, or if I go back out there and I stick my hand in the thing again, if I get all of the symbols? Let's go have a look. But yeah, basically there's black ooze on this island. Um, that all of the people on the expedition, when they came in, if they came into contact with it, they went solely mad and then tried to kill everybody. Um, which, you know, fun. But she's fine when she touches the black ooze because she has the blood of these fish people. So the current working theory is that she is basically descended from these fish people, but she didn't start getting the symptoms of this disease until her mother died. So we're not really sure how that works into it yet. Wait, can I not put my hand back in again? Is that it? Did I just get it once? Oh. 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 Well, now I'm confused. Okay. So do I... Hmm. I really don't know how this is going to work. I assumed that there was going to be another one. I don't think there's any- there's not another little face thing, so let's just head back inside. I'm glad I don't have to keep coming back out though, that, that's really annoying if I have to keep coming back and forth. But he drew pictures of something that I haven't found yet, so I'm wondering if they're through one of the doors? Right, okay, let's turn off all these- these lights. That turned it on, I'm an idiot. Yeah, I think I have to make the- well, not the center symbol. I think I've got to make the different, the different constellations on the doors. But I can only use the glowing thing. That doesn't seem right. So let's just turn this one off. Like that. Okay. So again, if we go around this way. She walks really slowly. Right. Is that it? Have I got that right? Yeah. So this is the view in the book. So I'm gonna- maybe I'll try and make the easiest one. Which appears to be... Uh, okay, hold on. I'm gonna bring my mouse in so you can see what I mean. I'm gonna try and make this one here. Which appears to be... That dot is that dot, I think. So I could do it like that. But how do I do that with just this shape? I have no idea. Maybe I can't. Maybe I can only do one of them. I could maybe do that one. I really don't know how I'm supposed to do this. Okay, I'm going to try and do one of them. The urge here to just push a random sequence of buttons until it works. Okay, so... Yeah, so that's that's that first bit started, and now I just need to go over to this one, I think. Do it again. Is that right? Yes! Okay, I think there must be another big face for me to stick my hand into. I love how this makes sense. Uh, through here, or another way to get the next button, because there's five buttons, and I can only push one of them. That doesn't make any sense. Let's go! Let's go! Ooh, another carving. It's not really a carving, is it? More I took print. them to a, a throne room. That was the final step in the ritual. That's where Harry probably is. Though, I don't know how he, If he thinks he and Nora... structure, riddled with nooks and crannies and endless stairways. Ooh. 
Cool. Um, if he thinks that him and Nora have to do the ritual together, then is he just waiting for her? Does he think she's going to find him? Aha, here we go. I was right. Fish face. Maybe it only hurts the first time. Ah, the second also hurts. Okay, so it adds a, it adds a uh, a symbol. It doesn't delete the last one. When I arrived on this island, I felt like I was trespassing. Mm -hmm. But now, I feel like this is where I belong. Intriguing. I wonder how I get down there. All right, so now we go back. Okay, I can't go down there. Now we go back and we um solve the next door and then we get another thing stamped into our skin and then we solve the next door until we get to the big door i have to go but i'm excited to see more of your streams thank you so much again for your sub i really appreciate it and i hope you have a great rest of your day thanks for being here it was very nice to meet you All right let's try this again okay so now i have another symbol um i now have like a little C. I still don't think I can do the bottom left one, but I can do the top left one, I think. Yeah, I think I can do that one now. If I turn off all of the ones that are currently glowing. And then I start again, because I think I know what I'm doing with that one. I hope this one of these doors gives me two uh, symbols at once, otherwise this is going to take forever. Right, so... I think... I go to this one. And I do that symbol. And then... Oh wait, hold on. I'm around here. And then I go to this one maybe do this symbol yeah I think that's right and then I need to go to this one over here I'm not 100% confident in that yeah I was right and the door stays open both doors stay open I think some of the puzzles in this game are pretty neat. Okay. Water this time, not black ooze. Actually, maybe the stuff in the in the main room was, was also water. It just looked like black ooze because it was so dark. Black and white figures. Oh yeah. It's chess. Ooh. Oh, this was the stuff that he made notes about. Well, I have no idea if I'm doing this right, but I'm going to go over here. Good doggies. Or dragons. Whatever you are. Oh. But I kind of go no, long, no further. Okay. Oh, it must be the direction they're pointing. It makes the little paths, maybe? So I need to turn them round. Yeah, like that. There we go. And this one, does that turn that one over there? Okay. I don't know if that's right. Oh, my foot's gone to sleep. Ah ha ha ha. Oh my god, it's gone completely numb. Ha! <laughs> oh my god. It's okay, it'll be fine. I'm just gonna wheel it. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Right. Now I'm intrigued. Wakey, wakey. Oh, oh, because this one's white. It turns the white, the white doggies around. Or dragons, or whatever they are. Is that 
path reach me if I push it now? Oh no, it only does two. Well, that's not very helpful. Hmm. Okay. Uh... kind of have to have these dogs and these dogs facing the ways that they are otherwise I can't get to this plinth in the first place so I'm not really sure how to do this unless I turn that that doggy Yeah, so those can now connect. Hmm. Hold on. Oh, you know what? If I have if I have the black doggies turn around when I get back over there, it doesn't matter if I can reach this plinth, because I'm not coming to this plinth to continue on. So if I turn those two around and then I turn that one around I should be able to reach the other side if I've got this right oh no I haven't I haven't got it right yet I need to turn these guys again no not that one that one that one was facing the right way okay I think I've got this right Now I need to go back this way. I like that she said, good doggies, because that's exactly what I would do. And then I need to turn this one closest to us. Oh, that's the wrong one. Oh well. Like that. And I need to turn this one like that. That should get me all the way across, I think. I know puzzles. I can do puzzles. Now I can stick my hand in a fish again. Again? Seriously? Ow! That hurt! Again! Fish bite! My favourite time of day. The fish bite time. I don't know why I said that. But there we go. That was what I that was what I thought I was gonna have to do. see it there. Catch all the I way think out. I can feel the agony of the slaves, their suffering, and the effects of their transformation. It's horrifying. Not a good time. Weirdly enough. Alright, another one's glowing. Wonderful. Let's clear off the ones that we had we had used so we can start fresh. I have not got the brain enough to uh, work them out as we go around. Okay, so now I can now I'll be able to do one more of them now with this new symbol. Okay. Braining is hard. You're not wrong. So can I do? Oh, I think I can do that bottom bottom left one actually with the double C I think 
Yeah, let's try that. I think that's going to be this one. Yeah, and then it's also maybe this one. I didn't realize we could have done that one last time. This place is like a labyrinth. Turn around, David Bowery. He was submerged in black icor. Icor! Wait, do people pronounce it icor? Am I wrong? Am I the incorrect Harry one here? Harry seems to be on the brink of madness. But I, I don't feel the slightest hint of confusion. Oh, I was gonna say, I On don't the contrary, care. I feel my mind is more focused than ever. Oh, this one was easy. I didn't even have to solve a puzzle. Just put my hand in the fish. Oh, come on. One more time. I think there's another one coming, actually. Ah. Which one is right? It's gonna be one of those things that it depends where you're from, I think. Like, what your uh, accent is or where you grew up. She's from Boston, I think. i -Core is American. Ah, there we go. That's fine. But... Look, another gate. Is that just what's through the last door? At least not standard English. There we go. See? Alright, let's get this really complicated one then. Or the most complicated one. I've still got a, I've still got a symbol missing. Well, I guess the last symbol will be through that door. And then the final thing will be to do the whole thing. Fill the whole thing in, maybe? Okay. Bye. Enjoy your alert. I appreciate your knowledge. Thanks for the tasty, tasty knowledge. Alright, let's try this. So, uh... Okay, this, is, this one's gonna hurt my brain. Oh no, wait, I think I can, I think, okay, if we start with the new symbol that we just got given on this one. This one. Then I think this one over here is the first symbol that we got. That one. Um, yeah, if I just break it down. That's me breaking it out, by the way. Um, that's that top bit that's really throwing me off, though. Oh, no, I guess... Is that... No, I don't think that's quite the same shape. Oh, no, it is. Okay, if we go around to this one, we do the new symbol that we just got. I think that's it. Yes, there the we go. Open, but where is the constellation I need to open the throne room? What in the sky? Maybe? Oh, maybe it's under the water. Another one of those gates. I have to get into the water again. Fish person! At least this time the gate back is right there. So it's this should be it's not stressful trying to find my way back. Fish, 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 fish. Oh, okay. So I just it's just a tiny little jaunt and then I come I'm back to a human again. Boom! Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Again? Seriously? Yes, it's the last one, though. Month. Ow! That hurt! Again. Okay, that's all of them now. I thought they looked squiddy too. I wonder if there's. If I can walk along the outside. One of the sides. 
Feel the torment of the thousands of slaves who perished here. I got, I got an achievement. I must have looked at all of the stone stuff or a lot of it or something. Maybe that's just me expecting Cthulhu. Everyone's expecting Cthulhu. It's when you don't expect Cthulhu, that's when you should expect Cthulhu. I don't think I can actually go over there. I think it's all just make the, the area look cool. Alright, let's see if we have to try and do the constellation in the sky. You know where constellations usually are. I feel like that's the answer. But I looked at it and I didn't, I'm pretty sure I didn't write it in my book. Oh, I didn't see that one. Right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and get this door open. When I've done that, I'll go on a break. Get myself some food. Yeah, I didn't write this down, which is weird. Hmm, an eye and a star. <gasps> Look at the stars, maybe. Well, that means I guess I, I probably have to... I probably have to draw it then? Like, manually? Okay, hold on. Um, let me quickly draw the... I put my pen pot right behind like something else, so I can't even see it. Draw this... little shape. Oh wow, this is a terrible drawing. so bad. I'm so glad you guys can't see this because this is terrible. And the big circles are there and there and there. And then there's little lines coming off. Yeah. Okay. Right. Short type right was one in the sky, I guess. Um, it's good. I'm not the one doing it. No, I've uh I don't think it is. Maybe it is. Okay, let's try and draw this. So that one, that one, this one, this one, and that one. Okay. The thing is, is I don't know how many of them are connected. I have a shape. I have a shape. It also means I can turn it, which helps. Um, I like expect Cthulhu when I'm at work, which is weird because I'm also near a body of water. Should I start expecting Cthulhu? Yeah, definitely. Just make it safer. That's not right. Oh no, yes it is, that is right. Um, and then we go over here. I turn the piece of paper that I have. Mm. No, that's not right. That's also not right. Oh no. That's wrong. That 
actually. Damn it. <laughs> I was like, that looks right. No, I think I need to do that little snake thing. Oh, I've lost track of where I am in the design now. Hold on. This is hard. Okay, so... Come over here. No. No. Yes. Just need to get no. Wait, where am I? Ah! That the door to the sanctuary is open. Time to find out what's waiting for me inside. And on that note, we're gonna take a quick break. I'm gonna go find some food, because otherwise I feel like I might pass out. So food is good. Um, I'll try and be as quick as I can. Uh, I will return shortly and we will find out what is through the door, whether it's Harry, a dead or alive, or something else. Let's get back to being a fish person. And the fish bite you. And there's a mystery door. Yeah, that's true. We're about to go through the uh, the mystery door. So, uh, welcome back to Call of the Sea. We have uh, opened the, the door in this temple. Uh, we're very, I'm presuming, very near the end of the of the game. Um, oh my god. That's not look, that doesn't look good. We may be about to find Harry or Harry's body or a fish person that looks like Harry. We don't know. That's what. Oh, that was the chapter name. Is that ooze? Oh, Jesus. Uh, there is whispering, by the way. In case you're wondering, that is not your brain doing that to you. That is uh, the game. I like to make sure people are aware of that because I know some people. Have hallucinations and get freaked out. Yes, also feel better soon, Luco. Alright, I guess we're gonna touch it. What a disturbing mirror. Oh, it's a mirror! Is it made of black icon? I I feel like it Touching is, it. It's speaking to me. Touch it. Oh, oh it's gone. Heavens. Oh heavens. Okay, good. Stop. Stupid deaths, stupid deaths, they're funny cause they're true. Woo! Stupid deaths, stupid deaths, hope next time it's not you. <laughs> I didn't do that quickly enough. Thank you for the stupid deaths. If I had died, that would have been very funny. Alright, I kind of thought I was supposed to go through it, or touch it. There's something written in the floor with blood. Fall Goffin? Haven't I heard that word in, in my dreams? Foul Goffin! No, no. It's purple coffins, not foul Goffins. Oh, okay, cool. I can go around behind it. I can't see a thing. It's so dark. I kind of hoped that was going to be fatal. That would be good timing. Uh. Oh! Okay, there we go. My god. Is that block moving? Oh, it is. Oh, it's making a stairwell for me. Okay. Nothing that happens here appears to respect the most basic rules of physics. Physics? Physics is for trouble. However, as strange as it may be, it does maintain a peculiar harmony. I'm just trying to make sure I don't pull off the steps. Are they going back and forth? Oh, they are! I did wonder why they hadn't gone any further. Like the workings of a clock. 
or a music box. I'm gonna turn off and save my husband. Ooh. There he is! Harry, is that you? Oh dear. Oh, I don't like this one bit. Can I go up here? No. Oh, well, I was supposed to keep looking at him. No? Okay. Oh god. The game is having a fun time! No, 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 no! Oh, I fell in. <laughs> Tell me this isn't you, Harry. It can't be you! It's lagging like crazy. Because of all the particle effects. Let's just give that a pause for a second. I want to see this this scene. But it's really struggling with all the particle effects. Okay, I don't entirely have a have a choice. Let's see if that helps. No, no, no. Oh, he's doing? dead. Oh my god, Harry, no! In the end you perform the ritual. You, you poor fool. But why? I don't understand it. Why? You knew it! You knew it wasn't going to work! You knew the ritual wasn't going to work. That's... That's why you never sat on the throne. You didn't even perform the ritual, did you, Harry? But you wanted me to think that you had. You even left a lure to confuse me. What? But why? Huh? This is our house back in Endel Englewood, by the way. Okay, I'm gonna turn the graphics back up now. I don't think that helped at all. Is it the lady? I guess. What really happened? The only person with you in that sanctuary beach was Cassandra. So if you didn't die, it had to be her. So where is he then? But also, how did she know that it wasn't him? How did she figure that out? I'm so confused. Did she use the dagger to open the gates and carry out the ritual? You tried to stop her, but it was too late. She shot you with your own gun and left you for dead, didn't she, Harry? I did wonder why she assumed it was Harry that got inside and not the other, not Cassandra. Because Cassandra was ambitious and would stop at nothing to uncover the secrets here. The island fueled that hunger for knowledge. Oh my god. Hide up. You had Where doubts about whether the ritual would work. What happened to Cassandra cleared up those doubts. The ritual wasn't for people like you. Non fish people. The ritual was only for people like me. But you refused to believe it until the island itself spoke directly to you. Haha, Falgarfen. She is our daughter. That's when you finally understood. You understood what my fate would be if I didn't come here and carry out the ritual. A slow and painful death. Ugh. So where is he then? So that's why he stopped replying to the letters. So you faked your own demise. And left your glasses near Cassandra's corpse. Those same glasses you never take off. Yeah. And you sent me the package from Dignity, Harry. Your picture, the key, the dagger. Another one of your scavenger hunts. So he is alive. And he's in Tahiti. And I took the bait. You made me come to this island, the same island where you almost lost your mind and your life. The same island where four members of your expedition perished. Why did you deceive me, Harry? You said you would never lie to me. Why didn't you tell me the truth? Why did you do this to me? Because you wouldn't have gone? 
I'm guessing she wouldn't have done it otherwise. Ooh, ooh, there we go. Because you knew that I would never accept my fate if it meant leaving you. Right, my love? Not even if staying with you would mean a slow and painful death. So the only way to get me to leave you was to make me believe you were dead. Aww. And you chose to live a life without me, so I could be who I really am. That's why you tried to deceive me. But I know you too well, my dear old pal. We've had so many years together, so many moments of love, happiness, understanding, friendship, a whole beautiful life with you. I know what you tried to do, but I can't let you make this decision for me, Harry. Either I embrace my fate and accept what I've always been, and leave you behind. Or I reject it and return home with you to relish the time that my illness gives us. Oh my god, I have to pick. It's my decision to make. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Ah, oh, jeez! To Harry or not to Harry, that is the question. Chat, chat, I need your opinion. I need your help, chat. What do you guys think? Personally, I think she should go and find Harry. Because what's she going to do as a fish person? Like, she seemed like a lot, she was like, I'm supposed to be here, I feel better, but like, just, she's gonna be alone? She's just gonna be alone for the rest of her life as a fish person, because there's no one else? I think we should go and see Harry. That's my gut reaction. I mean, we can keep. We can always come back to the save point and and see what happens with the other one. But yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. She became a fish person. She could go find Harry. Apparently not. Because look, there's so. I'm gonna go with this one. Done. You were right about it. one thing, Harry. I would never accept my fate if it meant leaving you. I know who I really am, and where I belong. I know fate has eternal life in store for me, but an eternal life oh, yeah, should be immortal. is worthless, meaningless. So, I choose the slow and painful death. I'm going back home. I forgot it also meant she'd be immortal. But you know, there's nothing stopping her coming back and becoming a fish person once Harry, you know, in like a couple of years if they if if Harry dies or something. Hold on, let me just lie on the ground until my world loads in around me. You staged this ruse because you love me. But true love is reciprocal. So I'm also making this decision because I love you. Our love is greater than fate, lineage, or or all the pain I can suffer. I mean, that's not why I'm picking it. <laughs> okay. Whatever time we have left, we'll spend together. Exactly. I just hope that he's when not. When time dead. comes, it will be your hand that holds mine. Unless you don't see And those beautiful blue eyes will be the last thing I see before I leave. I think that's reasonable. She did say, they did say they come back in three days, so I guess that's how long it took. So, you didn't find your husband on that island, Mrs. Everhart? 
I did find my husband. He wasn't on the island, though. What? What have you been doing these three days, then? What did you find there? I don't know. The truth about myself, I suppose. And at the same time, the reason to go back home. Oh, he's got to be mad. I don't think I follow you, ma'am. Have you ever been in love, Captain Hodgson? In love? You mean like in a romance novel? No, that's fiction, Captain. In real life, true love stories don't end with a wedding. Oh my god. They end with a funeral. And the only thing that eases that final moment of heartbreaking sadness are all the good memories lived together. Honestly, I don't think I've ever felt anything like that, Mrs. Everhart. But if you love your husband that much, he's certainly a lucky man. We are both lucky. And then she turns up in Tahiti and Harry's already dead from the gunshot wound. It got infected. Okay, are you oh, ready? Oh wow! Yes, I'm ready. One, two, don't forget the harmony. One, two, three. I'm happy this is being our canonical ending. All my life is empty since I went away. Skies don't seem to be so. She's singing again. May some angel send Jerry low and tall, of course. <laughs> while I stray and fate be kind to join us some sweet day. Oh, how I miss you, dear old pal. That's why they called each other old pal, because this was their song. Just want you only want you all the while. May God decree I have you back someday. Oh, how I miss you, dear old pal of mine. Each night. Honey, are you all right? I'm fine, Harry, don't worry. I can keep going. <coughs> no, listen, let's leave it for today. You shouldn't make any unnecessary efforts. <coughs> really, darling, I'm fine. <coughs> you need to rest, Nora. Come on, I'll take you to bed. <coughs> <coughs> oh, dear. She got another like sixteen years. Oh, actually, I don't. I don't know if the picture was from nineteen. They got a picture from nineteen thirty. I don't know if that's when the game started. Even today, so many years later, I still doubt whether I did the right thing. In the end, it didn't matter. You returned home and forgave my deception. We moved close to the sea and had a few more good years, didn't we? Hello, paradigm. Until you left me. That one sunny March morning. I wish I could be reunited with you. But fate has punished me with a long and sorrowful life. The 
No other incentive than my work. Because that is the only thing I have now. My dear old pal. That's it. That's the game. I was gonna reload it and see what the... <laughs> Start me. I was gonna reload it and see what the other ending was like, but I actually kinda don't wanna know. I'm happy with that ending. It was it was nice. Um Yeah. I arrived at the end. You arrived at the very end of the game. Um Ooh, you lost it today. How are you? I'm I'm good. I'm not good, that's a lie. I'm ill. Um, but I'm I'm doing alright. Uh I feel like well, part of me feels like the other ending would be sadder. Yeah, she'd just be on her own. She'd be immortal and on her own. And the only reason is that, you know, she's not in pain anymore, which I guess is is a good reason. But she wouldn't exactly be I feel like she wouldn't be happy. So I'm happy that, that she They had a bit more time together. Not where I expected the story to go at all uh, when I started. But yeah, that was uh, that was really interesting. I think that was a really good game. I would recommend it. Maybe not for multiple playthroughs, but just for a wee bit. Uh, just for one one playthrough. It was free on the Epic Store. It is no longer uh, free, unfortunately. But I'm sure it's not that much money. But yeah, thanks so much for watching. We played Call of the Sea.